As the sun set on the small, isolated town of Willow Creek, whispers spread through the community like a disease. Townspeople avoided eye contact and muttered about the Smith family, who had just moved into the old, dilapidated house at the edge of the forest. Rumors swirled about Mr. Smith's unsettling behavior and Mrs. Smith's haunting eyes. The children whispered of eerie lights flickering in the windows at night, and the adults spoke of strange noises coming from the house. But one thing was certain. Nobody ever wanted to go near the Smith's home. One day, a young reporter named Sarah arrived in town looking for a story to break her into the world of journalism. Intrigued by the rumors surrounding the Smith family, she decided to investigate further. Sarah knocked on the door of the Smith's house, and Mrs. Smith answered, her eyes wide and unblinking. Sarah felt a shiver run down her spine as she entered the dimly lit house. As she sat down with Mr. Smith for an interview, she noticed his erratic behavior, his twitching hands, his nervous laughter. It became clear to Sarah that there was something deeply unsettling about the Smith family. During her visit, Sarah stumbled upon a hidden room in the house. Inside, she found walls covered in manic scribblings and drawings that seemed to depict twisted, nightmarish scenes. The room reeked of decay and despair, sending a chill down Sarah's spine. As she delved deeper into the Smith family's history, Sarah uncovered a dark secret. Years ago, Mr. Smith had suffered a mental breakdown, leading him to commit unspeakable acts of horror. Mrs. Smith, traumatized by the events, had never fully recovered. The more Sarah learned, the more she realized that the Smith family was consumed by their own psychological demons. The house itself seemed to breathe with a malevolent energy, its walls bearing witness to the family's descent into madness. One fateful night, as Sarah sat in the house, surrounded by the echoes of the Smith's tortured past, she heard a sound that froze her blood. A low, guttural growl reverberated through the walls, followed by the sound of shuffling footsteps. As she turned to flee, she saw Mr. Smith standing before her, his eyes filled with a manic gleam. His, eye, his hands reached out toward her, and Sarah knew that she was in the presence of pure, unadulterated evil. With a scream, Sarah bolted from her house, fleeing into the night as fast as her legs could carry her, but the darkness seemed to swallow her whole, and she realized she was not alone. The spirits of the Smith family haunted the forest, their anguish wails echoing through the trees. To this day, the town of Willow Creek remains deserted, a ghostly reminder of the horrors that lurk within the shadows. And Sarah, if she was lucky enough to escape, would never forget the chilling truth she had uncovered, that sometimes the haunting whispers never truly leave.